Marcel Proust's Pleasures and Days is an intricate exploration of the fleeting nature of time, the complexity of human emotions, and the profound influence of memory. Written in his early years, this collection of short stories, essays, and poems lays the groundwork for the themes that Proust would later elaborate in his magnum opus, In Search of Lost Time. Pleasures and Days delves into the minutiae of everyday experiences, elevating them to the level of high art through Proust's meticulous prose. The title itself reflects a dichotomy central to Proust's worldview, the ephemeral joys, pleasures, juxtaposed against the inexorable passage of time, days. Proust's narrative technique, characterized by its elaborate detail and introspective depth, invites readers to linger on each moment, appreciating the richness of sensory and emotional experiences. The stories in Pleasures and Days often revolve around themes of love and desire, portrayed with a keen psychological insight. Proust's characters are typically ensnared by their own passions, revealing the often destructive power of desire. In one story, a character's infatuation leads to a profound disillusionment, highlighting the tension between idealized love and its often disappointing reality. This recurring theme is emblematic of Proust's broader philosophical inquiries into the nature of human experience and the ways in which our perceptions shape our reality. Proust's treatment of memory in Pleasures and Days foreshadows his later, more elaborate explorations. He suggests that memories are not static but are constantly reshaped by our present emotions and desires. This fluidity of memory is illustrated in the way his characters reminisce, often with a sense of nostalgia tinged with regret. The past is depicted not as a fixed sequence of events but as a malleable narrative influenced by the passage of time and the shifting landscape of the heart. The stylistic elements of Pleasures and Days are significant in understanding Proust's literary genius. His use of rich, descriptive language immerses the reader in the sensory experiences of his characters. Proust's sentences are famously long and intricate, mirroring the complexity of his characters' inner lives. This narrative style requires a degree of patience from the reader but rewards with a profound sense of immersion in the psychological and emotional depths of the characters. Pleasures and Days also addresses the theme of social class and the subtle gradations of social interaction. Proust, who was keenly aware of the social milieu of his time, deftly captures the nuances of class distinctions and the often painful pursuit of social acceptance. Characters in these stories navigate the treacherous waters of social ambition, revealing the superficiality and fickleness of societal approval. The collection's exploration of the arts and aesthetics is another crucial aspect. Proust demonstrates a deep appreciation for the beauty found in art, music, and literature, often interweaving these elements into his narratives. This appreciation is not merely superficial, it reflects a deeper belief in the transformative power of beauty to provide solace and insight into the human condition. Art, in Proust's view, becomes a means of transcending the banalities of everyday life and accessing a more profound, enduring truth. In Pleasures and Days, Marcel Proust presents a world where time and memory play central roles in shaping human experience. His meticulous attention to detail and his ability to capture the essence of fleeting moments underscore his belief in the significance of the everyday. Through his exploration of love, memory, social dynamics, and aesthetics, Proust invites readers to reflect on their own experiences and the ways in which the passage of time colors their perceptions and memories. This early work, while less expansive than his later novels, nevertheless encapsulates the essence of Proustian thought, offering a rich tapestry of human emotions and insights that continue to resonate with readers.